It's your boy Dan Poneman here. I'm here to talk about a kid I saw this past weekend. I drove all the way out to Iowa from Chicago uh, to see a kid named Jared Utah. In the last few months, he's completely blown up. He's gotten offers from 10 different schools, and most recently, he visited Butler, Indiana, Notre Dame, and Illinois. So I figured I had to come see this kid for myself. I was completely blown away uh, by this kid's game. Gordon Hayward 2.0. I might sound crazy, but he has a chance to be better. I would not be surprised to see him start popping up on national rankings as a top 40 prospect, maybe even better. He's got a beautiful outside stroke. Uh, he can handle the ball. He can post up. But what I was most impressed with was his passing ability. I, I was watching a game with Chris Colvin, who was Iowa State's point guard last year as a freshman, uh, won a state championship at Chicago Whitney Young. And Chris is not a guy who's easily impressed, but me and Chris were watching this game. On probably three or four occasions, there were passes that Jared made at 6'9", that both of us looked at each other like, wow, like this kid is for real. From Cedar Rapids, Iowa, uh, you know, not, not a big city, doesn't act like, you know, he doesn't have a big ego, he's not an arrogant kid. He was a really fun kid to hang out with. His mom's a really cool lady, happy Mother's Day to uh, Jared's mom. Uh, and me and him have the same favorite show, Seinfeld in the Office, which is, I thought was pretty cool. Um, anyway, I'm, I'm going to let you guys go and let you watch these highlights. I know you're going to enjoy them. They're only from one and a half games in the first game when I got there. Uh, it was already, they were already up 51 to 31 at halftime, so you don't have much from one game. But from the other game, uh, you can definitely see just from one game how talented this kid is and expect to hear a lot more about him over the next year and, and often when he's into college. He said he's actually trying to make his college decision uh, by the end of June, so whatever school does land him is a, a lucky, uh, lucky fan base. So without further ado, here is uh, me and Jared, Jared Utah.